Hey everyone, I'm just in the middle of editing and I thought I'd just interject with something you might find interesting, some extra visualization of what's going on in the research. So the research talks about the rate of sea ice loss not changing, so I thought it'd be helpful to see actually what the sea ice extent was like between 2005 and 2024. So in other words, you can see where the white is, that's 2005, my finger won't go all the way, but you can see what I mean. The white, that's 2005, the blue, that's 2024. So the ice has decreased significantly, right? You can see that over 20 years, the ice has gone down a lot. Uh, just the rate of sea ice loss hasn't changed. So this is essentially what it's like at this nice, slow sea ice loss rate. That's what 20 years looks like. And while we're at it, people often bring up the Antarctic when I'm talking about the Arctic, but you know, listen, I've, I've, I've talked about it in previous videos. I don't mess with the Antarctic. I don't, I don't do with penguin stuff, okay? But as people like to bring it up, I just want to show that the Antarctic's also in a terrible place. I get comments all the time saying like, oh, but the Antarctic's doing great. It's not. like So this was the sea ice is, is looking like in the Antarctic. See where the very little bit of white is. And the yellow line is what the average, if you like, should be. So yeah, I don't know. It's looking kind of okay there. It's not too bad in the Weddell Sea. But you know, it's terrible. It's also terrible. So uh, please stop lying that the Antarctic's doing fine. Okay?